All right, hey guys, what's up? It's Wolf here, one and only, and today we're gonna be checking out the new update. Finally, Infinity is here. I wouldn't be surprised if we go down for like some maintenance or something <laughs> for like another hour or so. But these are our login rewards, our special login rewards. Actually, everything's looking pretty damn nice, to be honest. But let's go in. Do we have any like story or anything? So these are our new logins. All right, so tomorrow I will get, oh, I'll get a 10 summon, basically. Okay, that's pretty damn nice. We get an ultimate overlord, and we also get a random infinity ticket on the 28th day. That is going to be really nice, actually. That helps out a lot. Now, there's a lot I want to try and, like, explore in this. This is our main logins. Okay, nice. Wait, is this the, um... Oh, this is the login reward that that people were talking about. The voting contest. Thank you. And we got these as rewards too. I'm going to hold on to those. Because I want to do summons first. Just in case I do get like a certain overlord or something. If I get like a infinity card for an overlord. I want to hold on, hold on to those. And generally, you guys want to as well, just in case. All right, so that's what the votings were. Okay, cool. Cool, they actually gave us the results. I'm voting for this. <laughs> Everybody should be voting for this. Uh, allow me to explain why. The first one, it really doesn't matter because you can easily get those hands down with like any reward in the game. Pretty simple. You can just get those through like farming. Not really all that useful. Essence extremely simple to get because of daily dungeon <laughs> you can get this much within like well you can get more than this in like a week uh the fourth one th these are just half of the things you can get from like daily dungeon <laughs> if not just like 10 more they just basically added on 10 more you can get so not really an ideal reward as for the rubies more important than anything on this list just because the absorb system the absorb system none of these two make no sense i mean this one could be like a slight increase in like stuff it's not like anything significant but this gives you more summons for the infinity summons that's basically why i would say that's the best one so let me go ahead and auto claim all these so yeah just basically give you guys a rundown on that and that's basically why everybody's choosing those as well. I'm just going to grab whichever one because I can just convert them over. Uh, close that. All right, let's go into the Infinity Summons. First, we're going to wait off <laughs> because I actually want to go over and look at these skins. Do they actually show how they look? Please show how they look. This is the thing I've been looking forward to the most just because new cars, new skins. Oh, I can't actually look at the design. Oh my god, that's loud. But these are all the skins we're going to be able to get from the um, alternate card. So, yeah. Damn, they look actually pretty nice. I like them. I think I'm going to be... I think I'll go after Mercedes, if anything. Because hers actually looks really nice. Then I'm going to go after Sasha. Or I'll go after Sasha first, actually. I'm going to go after Sasha, then Mercedes, then... Tears. Now I might get either one of these. I'm gonna try and get them all if I can. But we're gonna save this for later. This is gonna be pushed over to the side. We gotta go look at the rest of the stuff before we do that. All right. So what else was there? Tower is being taken out. Tower should no longer be here, unfortunately. Yep. But the tower is still in the background over here. You know, we will remember this pretty well. <laughs> ah. Feels bad, dude, because I actually enjoy Tower. They just needed to make it, like, work. I mean, it works, but it's, like, difficult work. Because it just starts up and one-shots us. So we got a free summon here. Let's see what's in it. Oh, it doesn't have any sound if I don't have my... Oh, well, <laughs> doesn't have any actual sound to it. Since I don't have a uh, music up, 
How much does it cost? Okay, 9,000 like we all thought it would be. Alright, let's see what we get. Is it all... Okay, no, I opened it myself. Soul. Another soul. Jesus Christ, souls? That's how we're going to start this off? I was about to say, dude, give me something else. Oh, Max. Oh, okay. I have her and Max. Cool. I'll take that. So many souls, dude. So many souls. I mean, I probably won't... I was going to say I probably won't be using souls if I get, like, a lot of, uh... Resources, but... Seems like mostly souls are going to come out of here. Unless you're, like, extremely lucky. At least give me... I about to say, at least give me one good thing. Purple... Oh, an infinity card for a Sig. Hold up. Let's let's go look at Sig right quick. Ah, uh, Sig, Sig, Sig. So we got a card for Sig. What is your affinity, buddy? Just in case I decide to actually get you out of the ticket. Uh, all the way down here. Jesus Christ, like. <laughs> All right, let's take a look. Uh, okay, I think everything has reset for like review wise. Let's take a look in here. Oh, exalted. Okay, so here's where affinity is. Okay, so right now he's overlord, but I can make him exalted, which will give him these instead. So, hold up. Let's go ahead and look at these first. So, this formation, defense formation increase by 8%. Not, not 8%. 8 seconds. <laughs> Evasion decreased by 10% and penetration by 10% for all enemies. Okay. Decrease both of those. Nice. Next one just increases the stamina and decreases physical damage for oh for sea vault all right the next one increases 40 percent stamina and decreases damage by 20 percent for all party members okay and our little flaming turtle i, I want to call him like charcoal is, is that what the little flaming turtle was Turkle or something like that. Pokemon Fire Turtle. Uh Turkle. Yeah, I was right. Turkle. That's what it was. I'm gonna call him Turkle for now on. <laughs> but increases his own HP recovery based off his attack for six seconds. Okay. Pretty nice. Now, if we go up here, yeah, I know we can do the same down here, but I think this will be a lot be better and easier. So, it increases by 20%. And, okay, so both decrease by 20%. Ooh, actually, this is going to be really damn nice for, like, tanking. Increases st stamina by 80%. And decreases damage taken by 50% for all party members. And more stats towards the Turkle. Okay, now he has extra, like, stats for this. For Siegfried, he, restore, he still restores HP for himself or how much attack he has. But he also now... When his HP drops below 60%, he becomes invisible for 4 seconds and recovers 15% of his max HP. This effect cannot be removed. Interesting. So, now when I enter Exalted, or I guess this would be Infinity next? Yeah, I think this would be Infinity. Infinity decreases... Evasion by 60%, but 
defense penetration still stays at 40. All right. Oh, dear God. He just gets a lot more. <laughs> oh, hold up. Yeah, he has a lot more. HP increased by 120%. Melee increased by 680%. And decreases 70% of damage coming in. And more stuff towards the um, Turco boss. Yep, it's just going to be a running meme at this point. Alright, so this time, he still gets the HP recovery. And he still gets the invisibility. But it's instead of four seconds, it's eight seconds now. It recovers HP. And every time defensive skill is used, well, defensive formation skill is used, increase the additional boss damage for all party members. And this stacks up to 12 times. Oh, so that's good for like long runs from what I see. His infinity. I think that's his infinity. Yeah, his infinity skill. Increases all physical damage for all party members and a family. For each Infinity Enhance, increase the physical damage by 18% and the families by 44%. Using Defensive Formation Skill increases melee damage for all party members and physical damage for the family. And additional boss damage. This effect can not be removed and it can stack up to 12 times. So I can actually see Sig being pretty decent in this, to be honest. Uh, let's keep going before I actually set in stone of who I'm going to be using for a while. Hopefully I can get another affinity card. Alright, something else is white this time. Oh, oh it's a transcendent. Okay, so transcendents are more of an orange color. What's this one? Another transcended. Alright, I'll take you. Why not? Oh. Another transcended. Jesus Christ. So many transcendents. Oh, but it's arced that time. I don't think I have her arced, to be honest. Alright, summoned once again. Okay, maybe I should not just drag that over. Maybe I should just click over. A lot of souls. Ah, my man. How? I hope I get a card for you soon. Alright. Next batch of <laughs> summons. But we're going to get another transcended. Alright. Art. Max. To be honest, the gotcha system has already been here. It's just basically basically pretty much upgraded and costs a lot more. <laughs> but from what the Korean version has shown me, or what people have shown me on the Korean version, the Korean version gets a easier way of acquiring um, Infinity cards by like an affection system, I think. I think that's what they told me. Ah, well, they go sick. I don't have to waste it on him. <laughs> I don't have to waste the um, card on him, apparently. Noted. Good thing I waited. Oh, I used to have you. Oh, your art. Oh, okay. It's actually a low percent chance of getting those, to be honest. Getting Overlord's arc, I believe. Hold on, I want to see... Does it actually pop up in chat of what we summon? Okay, no, it's it shows what card we get. At least I think so. Oh no, okay, it actually shows what we summon. Just that so many people are summoning <laughs> right now. I kind of saw this one coming. Actually, a lot of people summoning. So I don't really have to tap it again. I just tap it once as it goes to the next one. Come on, at least give me something. Let's say other than the soul. What is this? 
Momo, please be art. Thank you. Now I don't have to go back and freaking arc him. This is help me finishing out my passion effects. Thankfully. Alright, transcended. Ah, cool. This will also help me up my um assaulted sorry have. <laughs> All right. Nope. So what's this? Ah, damn. Full, full soul summon. God damn it. Make up for it. Ah, King Graham, you and your glorious beard, dude. Too bad you got nerfed like hell. I don't think you're coming back. I don't even think you're going to make a combat with your... Uh, Oh, I don't have you, and thank you for that, because that actually helps me finish out one of those passions. I don't think they're gonna able, <laughs> we're gonna be able to bring King Cram back at all. I, I just don't feel like his affinity is gonna be able to do anything. Hold on, I I need to go see because I just don't think you can make King Graham good anymore. I gotta pull, 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 pull. I need to get all the way down here. Where is he? Have I? Uh, oh, okay. I already had him. Where's that, I think? On the bright side, I can actually finish that. Alright, hold up. Uh, King Ram, where are you? I want to see your affinity, dude. Because I, I still don't believe you can... Actually, they can make King Graham... Back to him, old, to his old self again, right? Shouldn't they? <laughs> oh, actually. All right. So reduce active skills by five percent. Decrease crit damage by seventy percent. Increases max HP and defense by a hundred percent. Immune to insta kills. Oh. Reduce all damage from enemies by 70, 74% and increase their rec received melee damage. Increases max HP and decreases melee damage taken by all the allies. Well, for all allies, ignores all immunities and evasion to decrease attack. Of the enemy with the highest attack. Except bosses. By 50% for 9 seconds. I'm sorry if I'm starting all over the place. My apologies. This effect cannot be removed. And is only activated once. Okay. So like once he's in a battlefield or something. Hands increases melee damage received. For all enemies. Uh, I could think. Mm, I think King Graham could actually be pretty good. I, I feel like he probably could come back. May use one of the most OP tanks there was. I, I don't know. We have to see. You're just gonna give me another fucking King Graham. <laughs> it's like, oh, you said King Graham could come back. Here you go. Here's a, here's another one, dude. <laughs> fucking assholes. It seems like I'm mostly going to be working on um, Sigden. So I can get another one. That's fine. I actually like Sig's um, skills so far. What is it? Purple, please? Damn. No purples. Ah, Foxy. I haven't seen you in a while. What is this? Red... Oh, I actually never worked on you, so that's actually perfect. Another red, who is it? I've already gotten you to Arch, I think. At least I think so. Go ahead and keep summoning. Oh no, don't let it be it. Okay, I was about to say, please don't let it just be a soul summon. Okay, where's it? Till! Wait, hold up. 
What's up with Till? Hold on. Hold on. Hold on a second. Till, my girl. Hold. I actually enjoyed using Till back then. Till, 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 Till. Come here, come here, come here. Where are you? Yeah, you're all the way back here. God damn it. I'm sorry I'm looking at the skills and stuff like this, but I gotta look at what I got, okay? Okay, so... Let's see. So, until increase magic damage for all members. And increase attack speed for all members. So, she was more of like a magic increaser. She can actually be useful in my, like, jur jurist team. I'm sorry, I had a burp or something. It, it was coming up and it disappeared. Okay, well, fuck me. I can actually make this magic team pretty well because, um... I do have first crown and a few others actually. Ah, Tilk could actually be pretty good for that team. Increase all AoEs. Wait, hold up. So just increase max like magic damage for all party members. And decreases magic damage from enemies. Oh no, wait, hold up. Okay, no, increases the magic damage enemies receive by thirty three percent. But yeah, increases all AoE attacks and increase all AoE attacks from members when using protection of light. Okay, so this will be the passive increase and this will be the skill increase. So I can basically stack those. Alright, as for this, so that's skill. <laughs> Wait, does, um... Oh, the actual skills itself does change, like, damage-wise. I don't think it changes, like much anywhere else damn I didn't even read those either <laughs> goes to all party members and remember decreases cooldown so if you don't have um, Helios you can always go with good old Till okay it doesn't change it here Okay, so Overlord just stays the same. So for this... Actually, does much even change here? Oh, duh. <laughs> My bad. My bad. I totally forgot. So increases... To 36. Increases to... Uh, does that even decrease? No, it doesn't. It stays the same. So right here... 20... 33. Ooh. Increases to 70. It stays 33. How much do you increase AoEs by? Okay, it goes to 82 and stays at 55, right? No, 54. Okay, neat, neat, neat. I want to say it probably changes passives too, now that I look at it. So, 34. Oh, yeah, it does. So it just changes everything all around as you go up. Which is pretty nice. Pretty nice. So magic is increased by more when exalted. Wait, hold on. I want to see this, though. Okay, so that just stays the same. It doesn't change or anything. So just a slight increase when it comes to, like, um boost for like skills all right as for this this goes up like majorly and it adds on additional boss damage for all members and this stays the same as for this it adds on aoe and this increase oh I, I thought that was like light skill wait what <laughs> But Protection of Light now increases AoE damage and intelligence and additional boss damage to all party members. Stacks up to five times. And this is her infinity, right? So what does her infinity do? Everybody's main stats are increased by 180. 
for all members for this amount of time. Okay. Also, intelligence is increased by 150. AoEs are increased by 170. And stamina for all allies is increased by 32%. Every time you increase the infinity, it goes up to 32. Stamina increases by 8%. Yeah, she can actually be really good for a magic team, actually. Like, extremely good. I have a few ideas for that. I mean, Dragon, also, when you said this was probably going to be a long video, you was right. <laughs> I think I've only maxed you. I don't think I actually, like, arced you. Come on, give me something good. I mean, at least put, no, I was about to say, at least put it on Arch, at least. Okay, who is it? Ah, Mercedes! <laughs> Fuck yes! Mercedes, now I have an extremely good healer. Hold up. So, Mercedes and uh, both, both Mercedes and, who was it, who was it? Black. Both Mercedes and Black are going to be extremely good healers. Like, they're going to be amazingly good. Just because they were the ones who changed the meta a lot when it came to, like, reviving two allies. Once I get her to Exalted, oh my god, that's going to be amazing. Instead of just relying on, um... Instead of just relying on Blaze Eater, I can rely on her to heal and revive. So that's going to be amazing. All right, so let's go to Overlord so I can actually see more stuff. So for Overlord, well, for Transcended stats, she when she dies, she heals all allies or a portion of her attack for this amount of seconds. And when the skill extends... Oh, when the damage extends 10%, she only takes 10% of the damage. Oh, so she can't be insta-killed. Well, not insta-killed by, like, skills. She just can't be, like, one-shotted. Alright, so attack and attack speed is increased for all party members. This effect stacks. Our party members revived. All party members are revived when using... Song. Oh, so that's what, um... Ah, okay. I see. I see what you mean, Dragon. When you were inside of uh, my stream. I see what you mean about the whole revive all party members. I was not paying attention to that. To be honest, I didn't really think about that. That's actually... Actually, eh, that could actually be pretty good. But, I don't know. I, th I think I kind of still prefer Black a little bit. But this can also be a good choice. Extremely good, actually. Alright, so increase all party members' attack by 30% and their defense by 32, 34% when using the third skill. Nice. Nice, nice, nice. Oh, no. Not when using that. When using the uh, first skill. <laughs> My bad. I misread all of that. So under the stars would be this. My bad. But yeah, I got that right. That's that's the third skill. All right. I'm processing a lot. I'm sorry, dude. I'm all over the place. This is new updates. I'm taking it all in as much as I can. It's it's, it's so much to process, okay? Leave me alone. <laughs> all right, so it increases the more HP you gain for that portion when she dies. All right, next. The attack is the only thing that increases, not the attack speed, I believe. Right? Yeah, the uh, the attack is increased, not the attack speed. Can still stack up three times. As for this, 
Defense stays the same, but attack is increased for all party members. Okay. So, Exalted. Nothing here changes. Okay, never mind. God damn it. Wolf, pay attention, dude. <laughs> okay. So, when, <laughs> when Mercedes dies, it increases it by even more. So, I don't think anybody's dying anytime soon, to be honest, if she dies. But then again, it's a hard time to try and kill her. All party members reset. Skill cooldown for all activates. When she dies. Okay. Nice. So that gives everybody a boost of skills. Increases attack. But attack speed stays the same. But increases physical attack for all party members. Fantastic for physical teams. Next. Third passive. Increase all party members' attack. Their random damage. Decreases the damage they take from AoEs. And when using the first skill, increases still defense is still the same, basically. Decreases damage received by Mercedes by 60%, so she lives way... She's harder to kill, basically. When using the first skill, dispel all debuffs from all, from all allies. I recover a portion... Oh, recovers HP portion of okay that actually can be extremely good now infinity is probably where she shines let's see increase all physical damage in stamina which is pretty much hp decreases damage taken for all party members all right so that's just basically all of it each affinity increases physical damage and stamina Okay, and decreases Mercedes cooldowns by 30%. 30%? She's just going to be an insane healer. I got to look at Black later. Jesus Christ. Actually, Mercedes is probably the best damn healer, <laughs> to be honest. So, uh, so I give it to you, Black. You're, I mean, give it to you, Dragon. You're, you're right. <laughs> yeah, kind of better. Until I look at black later. What do we get here? Another one. It's max. Give me something I don't have. Thank you. Oh, and it's the ultimate? Okay. That, that's one another member of the overlords. Of the first batch of overlords that I don't have. So I only have two more summons now. Come on. Give me something good just to end off. If you're gonna give me to uh, you fucks, <laughs> you fucking bastards! How could you clickbait my life like that? How rude of you! At least give me something good on the last one, right? Give me one more good thing. What is it? Ah, I haven't seen you in a while. Okay, what is it? Arch ultimate. Okay, that's fine. Come on, damn it! Well, that was basically my summons. Ah, uh, the go, the golden gem out of this. Mercedes. But I don't have her ally, so I gotta go make that. God damn it! <laughs> Just when I thought I could avoid <laughs> wasting my like, stuff for her. But I don't think it's going to be all that hard, to be honest. Oh, I already have a free... Okay, never mind. <laughs> so I can just make one right now. Hold up. Hold up. Let me just go to Mercedes. Because I honestly want to try getting her there. Because I'm interested to see how this all works. Okay, Transcend. Excuse me? Oh, okay. Well, I... I... Believe I have... Oh, it has to be normal? To... Oh. Okay. 
All right then. I did. I did not know that. Well, now you know. <laughs> Apparently, the fuck. I wish there was a skip button for this. By the way, I mean, yes, it's cool looking at my character go up, but skip button would be nice. <laughs> for some reason, it has to be ultimate. But, you know. Hey. <laughs> At least I have enough units for that. I thought it honestly went to DFI, but alright. God. Hmm. I'm puzzled. <laughs> I'm actually genuinely puzzled right now. I'm not gonna lie to you. I am actually puzzled about that one. But alright. And now I gotta, you know what? I'm just gonna do this. Just, just refresh it. So this also has to be like, yeah. I don't think there's a Zorp system for you, buddy. So you're gonna have to go up the old fashioned way. <laughs> it's not gonna cost like too much resources, just because they, they've changed it to where it doesn't take like a lot anymore. I mean, this has been added, that is. And this was just four. But now, once she's over, I'm pretty sure that's where the pain starts. So I need... Wait, what? Limit break. The fuck? <laughs> I, I was so confused. I was just like, wait, what? Hold on. So, this is how you get her to Overlord. So, you need another card afterwards to get her there. To. Ah, okay, I see. I see, I see. So, you would have. So, I have to get lucky just to get another one. Well, that's going to be a pain in the ass. Uh, let's grab you, 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 wait, am I done with that? No, I'm done with these. Mendelandy, I'm done with. Who else? I actually am done with you. Perfect. At least I know where I'm going with this. But I do want to make sure that I have all of my passion buffs already settled. With the transcendence. Alright, so I'm done with Mika. Noted. I'm done with um pretty much all of these characters jeez not done with Tracy okay Foxy is not done Hal is not done Foxy and Hal are the only ones I have to keep noted Don't need you. Don't need you. Don't. Well, actually, we're gonna keep you just in case. I'm keeping Death Crown just in case I get one. Get rid of this. This. Oh, your ultimate now. Ow. That that was loud. But okay. Don't need you. Don't need you. Don't need you. 
So the rest of it, I can just do this. Okay, noted. So now all these guys got arch skills too. I don't know if, I don't think they have infinity. Nope, nope, they have infinity cards. All right, noted. <laughs> I didn't think they had infinity, but all right, prove me wrong. Prove me like very wrong. Too lazy. Go up there. Appreciate it. So we have quite a lot to do. So I just need one more card for her. One more. And she will be assaulted. Okay. That's going to be annoying. How much do I need? I just need 20. So I just need like... Seven more? Seven more, I think? Convert. Yeah, I know I don't have that much gold. You're insane bastards. <laughs> I'm not even going to attempt it. <laughs> You're not going to get me on that one. So, I need another card. <laughs> oh, man. Summon system's gonna be tough. It's gonna be real damn tough. For sure. But if I can get, like, one more, that'd be perfect. Also, I think the Angel one is... Isn't that the one that you need for, um... Getting Infinity afterwards? Like, this chick... At least I think so. No, nah, I'm, I'm probably thinking of something else. At least I thought that's how how it worked. But no, I guess you just enhance up there. But yeah, that's pretty much the summonings I've been through. Noted. I'm also going to work on Sig as well. This is a good thing I collected all those for Sig. Actually, I'm not even sure if I can... If I want to do that. Ah, okay, so... Who do I not have done? I don't have you done. Don't have Chi done. I don't have C done. Don't have Asia done. Hmm. There's a lot of stuff I don't have done, actually. But decreased damage are already done. Main stats. Not sure if I want to go into that yet, but the fixed damage and AoE damage. I think I might take the fixed... Fixed damage. So now that should complete. Yep. Now we have maybe more fixed damage. To be honest, it's gonna, it's gonna be really hard, but... Also, about the tier list, um, it's going to be weird trying to do this, but I'm going to try my best to get everything done. We're not going to go for, like, um, tier 1 or tier 2 like that. We're, I'm more going to give the community, like, still the sense of them wanting to build their own team and not just, like, telling them what characters are perfect for this. Because they're still going to need buffers and, like, certain good units. Um... Things like that. Uh, the tier list, I'm probably going to just do like the average, like some of the average tier lists is how they uh, pretty much give you a sense of, hey, 
this character can do pretty well in this category this character can do pretty well in this category i'm just not going to be like this character's top tier as a tank or this character's tier one as a tank or anything like that you know so we're going to try and go for something a little bit more understanding i'm trying to at least help a lot of people out a lot of new people who come into the game because there's a lot of new players who find dragon blades for the first time and i want to try and help them out so i'm really hoping that most of you guys will help me on the tier list as much as you guys can but we're gonna let sub let infinity settle in a little bit it's gonna be really difficult for everybody to get like the certain stuff they need or want for sure it's gonna be quite a rocky road so yeah ah <laughs> uh, this is gonna be fun all right so who else who else who else so i could get chin for the main stat increase how much did that increase okay well i'll go fuck myself then <laughs> uh, i i Dance. That was just gonna max that out, but all right. Unless I'm an idiot and I did something wrong here. Okay, no, I didn't do anything wrong. It's max. It just didn't tell me that it was okay. What ifs? What ifs? So I can get these two if I get C's, and I can get Ban for the defense, or I can get Chris. I'm gonna get C's. Where is she? The fuck? Am I blind? Oh yeah, I'm blind. There she is. Alright, so that's done. So now, for these two. Man, what do you all increase? I don't know. How many more do we have? We have like two more? Yeah, we have two more. I would have to summon for one of these. Or make them myself. There's going to be a pain in the ass for resources for sure. Jesus Christ. Um, hmm. I could take melee damage. Actually, I could skip out on that. And just take these two. Get two additional buffs. Instead of just taking a one for ban. I'm going to do that instead. So, Miku, who I'll probably never use, I'm just going to go around just reading every last single skill when I get the chance. That's all I know. Wait. Oh, I was about to say, she and I, I'm, I must be, like, really blind at this point. I must be. My eyes. Well, actually, I can get banned later, actually, because the last day we also get another... Overlord Selector, which will be perfect unless I get somebody else. But Ion needs to be increased, though. All right, fantastic. We actually got those out of the way. Now we have a whole bunch of these. Fan freaking tastic, dude. Ah, uh, updates always fun always fun is there like new areas too for the story i don't think there is unless i'm wrong i could be wrong yeah i'm wrong <laughs> what you got here oh so you just have like normal death crown so, where is the area for this? 
Hello? I should be done with this, right? Okay, there are no quests ongoing at this time, so it's not a... What the fuck? Okay. <laughs> that came out of nowhere. All right, then. Ah, oh, hi, buddy. How you doing? Okay, no, I, I think we already read this. This is just re basically like replaying. And at this point, he cut off. Alright, so now we're entering Chapter 7. I will do this on the next video, next week, for sure. As of right now, I need to focus on doing all of my dailies, doing every single daily that I come in contact with for my crystals. I also got to do arena. I got to do all sorts of things. Because everything in the, in the game gives you a crap ton of rubies. So do every single thing. Don't just lazy out and just be like, ah, oh, well, I don't feel like doing that today. Every single thing in this game basically gives you rubies. Everything like guild tournaments and stuff like that. From arena. Everything inside of this section gives you rubies. Well, except for Orc Fortress, but we're not going to put that on the list. This, these, gives you a whole bunch of rubies. Well, these three gives you a whole bunch of rubies. This doesn't. Everything, well, not this. Everything right about here. These four things also gives you rubies. Join every last single one of them. Like, I almost forgot to participate in that, but we're not going to talk about it. But yeah, join every single last one of them. It is crucial. If you want to keep doing summons. Look at look at all that. Everybody's getting Mendelandy and... I, will, I dare someone to get a fucking exalted card. We're going to throw hands right here, right now. I mean... I mean... Anywho, we're going to end off there. Hopefully... You guys enjoy the update. And hopefully it helps you out, like, a lot more. But... Yeah, that's pretty much it for me. I'm going to go read the rest of these skills, and I will see you guys on the next one. And till then, peace out. Oh yeah, I almost forgot uh, Raid 2. So, I just got her to Arch. So see, let's see. When you get past the interest, you can join other players in the Raid. Oh, okay. So to be able to do it like this and invite your friends and stuff you have to pass it solo so nobody can carry you through it oh okay so it's like a beginning test to see if you're strong enough even for the raid so that's something they're doing new hey, I did turn down the volume just because it was like a little bit too loud so yeah alright so I gotta <laughs> finish my exam I guess Oh, he has a shield. What the fuck? Alright, let's see if we can do this. How long does this normally take? That's a real question I should be asking. Come on. Almost there. Alright, the shield is about to come off. Now it's all about our damage from this point. Oh, and he can also take debuffs too. I don't know if he has like any type of like passes or anything. Hear me. This will be your last life. I don't think I like that. Mine, almost there. Oh wow, he just wipes you out from that point. What the hell? Why does he? Why are we making a boss that just 
completely wipes your team afterwards. We were close to the last one. Ah, well then. Um, well, shit, fuck me, right? <laughs> really? Is that what type of boss we're making now? Alright, then. Well, that's gonna be difficult to get past. <laughs> Just made a straight up boss that one shots you at the end. And also, to get these to arc, you would just need two of these, also. Just just letting you guys know that. But I kind of want to save those if I can. But I don't think I'm able to. I think I'm going to use you. How much would it take to do these? Alright, since I already have a ultimate one, I'll use the max. I already have a chin arc, so I'm going to use that. There we go. Perfect. Alright, so now she does it more boss damage. Seems for some reason L is like way stronger than Violet. I don't know what to transfer this stuff into yet. At least not yet. I think I'll just keep going uh, warrior for now. But yeah, let's keep going. <laughs> well, let's try again, actually. If that doesn't help, oh, shit, I don't know what does at this point. Because this boss just is like, fuck you towards the end for some odd reason. Oh, maybe? Nah, I don't think Kronos is going to work, actually. Because Kronos is not going to survive that long. When I think about it. So, is it now that you have to actually kill the boss inside of the group together? Well, actually, I think you already have to kill it. I haven't been in raid in like a, a while. Can you guys tell? <laughs> Come on, almost there. Alright, let's see how this works out. Oh, is it like a time limit? Come on, guys. Jesus Christ. Oh, it's a time limit thing. That's what it is. Oh, you have to beat him at a certain amount of time before he one-shots. That made complete sense now. Okay. All right. I get it. Uh, his, his design is a lot better than I thought it was. His face is still creepy, but looks a lot better than what I looked at first. <laughs> so now I can farm this raid. So that makes sense. Okay. So just maxing these two just helped out a lot more. <laughs> Jesus Christ, that thing was insane. Well then. Hope you guys enjoyed i'll see you guys on the next one i'm officially gonna end it off until then peace out